What's going on guys? It's your boy Adjen Bagen for another Outer Plane video. And for today, it's time to showcase a DPS Mero build. Yes, some of you might be wondering how is the damage of Mero if you build her as a DPS character. Because usually, you will build Mero as an opener, right? But what if you build Mero with some form of DPS? So this is my Mero's DPS build. So she has 3,111 attack. Uh, the speed is not is below 300 because I prioritize uh, some damage. 285 speed, 54.8% uh, critical chance. This one will become uh, max at 100% uh, with Valentine's buff. Critical damage 222% and 204 accuracy. And I'm using a penetration necklace. Uh, this one is not the best uh, substats that you can ask for. If I have some attack here and some uh, crit damage, it might be better. But this is my best penetration necklace. So yeah, I think this one will uh, suffice. Uh, I'm running speed set, of course, because uh, I need uh, to make her a bit faster. So that she will take a turn and get her immortality buff as soon as she can. Because uh, that one will save her uh, from damage. And that is how you will utilize her as a DPS character with her immortality buff. Since uh, you will have some increased damage uh, when her HP is on the low side. So just the typical uh, speed gear. Uh, nothing too fancy about this one. And then I have some gems. Uh, attack percent gems to have more attack and then some critical damage gems skill the same all max out except the chain passive uh, my valentine is my opener in this uh, team 324 speed uh, plus 10 from uh, main it's around 334 speed uh, i'm fighting almost the same uh, enemy but instead of the aste it's demidraka my damage dragon is only a 3 star so I cannot fully utilize her. So I'm still using uh, the Aste here. Let us see how this uh, will do in this showcase. Uh, even if my uh, damage uh, Demi Aste got uh, deleted by damage dragon, uh, I believe I can still uh, do my thing if my uh what do you call this if mero can still uh do her thing so i'm gonna be pushing let us try to deal with uh demi dragon here i will get pushed back does not matter Oh, my Demi Aste take the turn first. <laughs> Not my Mero. So that is her damage, 22k. Uh, since the Mero there has a uh, immortality buff, right? Oh, my Mero is died. No wonder. My Mero is dead. Uh, just take a look at her damage here. This one does not crit. 3k without crit. Look at the enemy, uh, Mero. It's g g giving some dam nice damage, right? As you can see, the immortality buff is really annoying, right? 
that is where, where we will utilize it. 10k attack. <laughs> Normal attack. I think Mero is a really good DPS, sub DPS. But it, the, that showcase, it does not go well. Yes, it, it did not turn out the way I want it to be. Uh, let's try to fight one here. Uh, this one. Because I was not able to showcase the S3 with Valentine's buff. Now, I will showcase Mero's S3 here. Just take a look at the damage here. There are no type advantage in this enemy. Let us see the damage here. 25k not bad not bad not bad for a uh, ranger but i think notia is still uh, better compared to damage with regards to uh, the damage that they produce well the Astre still carries the team. As usual. As per usual. But as you can see, Mero as a sub DPS is also pretty nice. It's pretty nice, but it requires some heavy gear investment. Yeah, it requires some heavy gear investment uh, with that uh, kind of lineup. So, what else? Let us try to fight this whale team. Six star them in Rakan. <laughs> I don't know if we can uh, do something about this team. But since this is a showcase, let us see if my three star Mero will be able to do something with regards to this type of team composition. Oh, it's very slow. Uh, let us see the damage. Come on. Twenty-two. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. It's really annoying against that type of Leo. So yeah, my DIA stay got deleted. Of course. But let us see if, if Mero can carry the team. Let us see if Mero will be able to carry the team. The damage is not that good against this type of uh, enemy. And I've already talked about this in my uh, full Mero guide yesterday that Mero has a lot of weaknesses, especially this type of uh, high chair arena defense team composition. As you can see, she cannot do anything against this type of team composition. But Having Mero as a uh, sub-DPS is not a bad thing in my honest opinion. I believe it's not a bad thing having Mero as a sub-DPS. But you have a lot of other options. And as, as I said also yesterday, uh, Mero will probably shine in RTA. Not in this uh, regular arena where there are a lot of really annoying characters. Because in RTA... Uh, you can ban annoying characters that counters Mero. Uh, are there any other teams that we can showcase? Uh, maybe here also. Six star Demi Drakan. Again, six star Demi Drakan. It's really hard to pull it off. 
But we will see. Oh, the Demi Astray enemy is 71%. Let us see. Oh, 26k damage. And here is another weakness of Mero. She can proc counter attacks from enemies like this, Tela. The good thing about DPS Mero is that, as you can see here, uh, she will survive the Aste's uh, revive attack. She will be able to carry this one because of her immortality buff. And as I said, DPS, she has enough damage to finish off this type of enemies. As you can see, finish off. Yes, I can finish off the Aste, as you can see. Uh, but this one, this one has, invul has an invulnerability buff. So we cannot do something about this one. Other than just to wait it out. There you go guys. I think that is all for uh, this uh, showcase of DPS Mero. Uh, it's really not that bad. But as I've said, it's it requires some heavy gear investment. You need some really good gears to pull it off. Uh, if you're wondering, my DS day is using my uh, immunity set. Uh, this is the start of my DS, 3.9k, 80% critical chance, 210 crit critical damage uh, using penetration uh, accessory here. And there you go. I think that's it for me for today guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave a like and subscribe. I would really appreciate it if you could help me grow my channel more. And thank you to everyone who are supporting my channel. I appreciate every one of you. Until next time, peace.